Mosaic FM Yo, yo, Mast Wolf here in the house on Mosaic FM. How you doing? Let's get it. Mosaic, what's up? <laughs> okay, so we're really thrilled to have you here on Mosaic FM from Tunisia. I mean, Astronaut in the Ocean is the biggest hit right now on Spotify. I mean, it's top three in, uh, you know, Spotify Global. It's been like for, for many weeks on the top five. We're really happy to have you here to discover who is Masked Wolf, who is Harry Michael, just the man behind this, you know, masterpiece. So just to start it off, uh, I mean, who is Masked Wolf and how is, you know, the, the change, the transition from uh, Harry Michael, who started rapping at 13 years old, just to, uh, you know, arrive into Masked Wolf, top five on Spotify charts and, you know, the hit song Astronaut in the Ocean. Um, I mean, like, who is Mars Wolf? I, I've always said, like, I'm a very authentic mm -hmm. uh, rapper, uh, first and foremost. So everything you hear from me is basically about me or has t uh, some type of message to it. I mean, how did Mars Wolf come to play? Very good question. Um, it took about a decade for me to figure out, like, my sound, maybe even a bit longer. And uh, for me... Uh, like the reasoning behind Mask Wolf was because I always felt like I had a mask in front of me, on me, and I wasn't showing my real self. Uh, but when I went into the studio, it was like the the transformation. The wolf came out, the full moon, and the uh, the beast unleashed, as they say. Um, so for me, like I wanted to show people that I was actually really made to do this, and that, that's how I thought the name would fit the best. Exactly. I mean, you know, what, what's the, what's the difference between you when you started rapping at 13 years old and I mean, your songs right now, let's take, for example, Astronaut in the Ocean. What's the big, you know, the main difference between your rap at 13 years old and your rap now you're 29? I mean, uh, I would say the message definitely is one of the biggest mm -hmm. part of it. There was no message even when I started from 13 all the way up to like 25, 26. I didn't really have a message in my music. It was just rap to rap and mm -hmm. whatever comes to your head. Now it's more direct and it's more personal. Uh, and obviously the sound changed a lot. I developed like a specific unique sound. That I think uh, you can't really say he sounds like this person exactly or he sounds like this other artist exactly. And I wanted to always be unique and be unidentifiable it's just i am mass wolf i am my own sound okay that that's really a good you know a good transition from you know your rap from 13 years old and you're now 29 as i said and uh i mean astronaut in the ocean is pretty much the hit of 2021 and 2020 i mean when you released it in 2019 uh, I mean, in some interviews that I read on the internet, you said that you knew that was going to be a hit, a banger, you know, just all over the world. But what happened from 2019 till the re-release in January 2021? I mean, how did Astronaut in the Ocean just take off after almost two years of uh, the first release? Um, I just think that COVID played a big part in uh, like everyone being inside having to listen to music, cook, clean, sit down, watch whatever, and then listen to music all day. And I think like from 2019, I built my following from zero, you know? Mm -hmm. So everything I did, all the socials I had was literally zero followers. And I think that that is why it took time. Like it's uh, a lot of people in this world have a great product but you can't just automatically put it on the shelf in your in your shopping mall you know what i mean and that uh, you're shopping or where you go and do shopping so for me it was like we had a great product which was astro and obviously i felt like i was a good artist but how do we get it out there and then over you know two years uh it just kept building 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 and all of a sudden it's in every shop and now everyone can purchase it you know what i mean so um mm -hmm. i think it just took time and uh, organic reach like a natural reach 
Yeah, exactly. That that's what's special about Astro. Uh, I mean, the song is so authentic. I mean, a lot of people just said uh, in the comments also of the video, you know, you saved my life. Uh, this song really relates to me. Uh, it, it just, you know, it talks about me. I mean, how how did you do that? I mean, uh, uh, what is your relation with your fans? That that's the first question because there are a lot of comments uh, on your videos, positive comments, just saying, yeah, I relate to that. This song is about me. I mean. How did you do that? I mean, everyone goes through something, right? I mean, to, mm -hmm. to say that to like we have people in royalty and people that have millions and millions of dollars that still come out and say they're mentally depressed. I mean, it's not just for the poor. It's not just for the rich. It's in every human human physique and, and their brain that something will always go wrong. And that's just how we think. And that's just how life is. So for me, when I was creating the song, I just wanted to I guess express and open up to show that I was like finally like ready to talk about like what I was battling in my life and just to say you know like when I go what you, what you know about rolling down the deep it was like kind of asking your story as well tell me like trying to like gear you up not to be afraid to tell me like how you feel mm -hmm. yeah that, that's pretty much it you know the, the lyrics itself just you know there are a lot of meanings i mean we you could understand that from the lyrics uh, themselves that this song is positive i mean it just gives a positive outcome just saying yo you know this is an experience you go through that and yeah you can make it but also it just shows that uh, you know th there is I, I, I mean personally i think there is a hidden meaning in that in the lyrics themselves i mean there is a little bit of harry michael there's a little bit of mass wolf there is a little bit you know of yeah this is me this is my my product and uh, i mean uh, is it is it are you are you pretty much satisfied with astronaut in the ocean like right now if you're not satisfied with the outcome of what's happening you're pretty much greedy right yeah exactly so for me i never i always say i never expected it to be to be this big um so everything that's sort of happening is a blessing so really for uh, yeah the answers i'm very happy yes yeah, the, the, I mean, yeah, it, it's in the top three right now on Spotify. And yeah, we've had it really, really here broadcasting on Mosaic FM. Tunisia loves Astro. And uh, yeah, for that, there is a, re a big request uh, here from our friends in the studio and even the, uh, you know, the host. Uh, could you song? Uh, could you sing us a little bit of Astronaut in the Ocean? I mean, we just want to hear it live, you know, right now from Mass Wolf. Sure. What you know about rolling down in the deep When your brain goes numb You can call that mental freeze When these people talk too much Put that shit in slow motion Yeah, I feel like an astronaut in the ocean She said that I'm cool I'm like, yeah, that's true I believe in G-O-D Don't believe in T-H-O-T Yo, 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 yo. Live performance from Masked Wolf here, Astronaut in the Ocean. I mean, it's pretty much the biggest hit right now. And uh, yeah, it did take two years to just to kick off. And uh, uh, I mean, after Astronaut in the Ocean right now, just Masked Wolf uh, went from not being like, from being unknown in the music industry to being like pretty much already in the uh, top three on Spotify and also Billboard. You're top one in many countries, I mean, uh, uh, that we know of and uh you know what's what's next what's next for mass wolf what are your what are your your future projects is there anything in the near future to be honest i mean even a single or, or an album what's next for mass wolf uh basically all the above so i'm working on singles at the moment a lot um we're basically getting them finalized so they're like ready to go nothing has to be done to them just they're just sitting there waiting and uh i'm currently working on the album uh so i'm hoping like that's an end of year release or start of next year release but uh i'm really excited to actually like put an album to my name like a proper album and then obviously touring as well as another big thing um but with covid we're just waiting and pending and then once we can actually fly or go somewhere then we're off yeah exactly i mean with the tours we'd love to have you here in tunisia to be honest this is an open invitation for you to just come here in the studios of mosaic fm and just maybe tour a little bit i mean pretty much everyone here loves your song pretty much relates to it and uh you know uh you have a last word to say to our audience here in mosaic fm what would you like to say this is a pretty much a new audience for you and uh yeah what would you like to say to this new audience 
Uh, I'd like to say thank you for your support. Uh, welcome to the Wolf Pack for the people of, that have just <laughs> yeah. heard uh, Astronaut or Astro. And if you are striving to be something, no matter what it is, put the years in, put the work in. It doesn't happen straight away. And pain is part of the progress. Yeah, that, that, that's a really powerful message from Mast Wolf right here. Uh, this was an exclusive interview, interview from Mosaic FM. Thank you for accepting the invitation. We're really thrilled to have you here. And uh, maybe future, I mean, when you have a new release, we'll, we will definitely have it here on Mosaic FM. But right now, we're going to listen live to Astronaut in the Ocean from exclusively from Mast Wolf. This is Mosaic FM. You are here with Bennett FM. Oh! Mosaic FM.